everybody welcome back to my channel and thank you for watching another one of my grocery shopping haul videos hey 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 it is I back again with another small grocery shopping haul and look like we found some more chicken wings and this time they came from this bag they made this bag huger I do not remember this bag being this big but this is a 10 pound bag of what they call it first and second chicken wings this the kind well i don't know if all of them got that stuff in there salt whatever they put in here but anyway it's gonna do for now until i get fresh ones like i got the other day but anyway uh this came from what is it smart and final so we got this big old bag yep like I said, this is a small grocery haul. Just want to share my husband and I. We just want to share our little groceries. One day he gonna get in my video and y'all gonna meet him and he gonna talk more shit. <laughs> but anyway, let's see. Y'all been looking at the news. Y'all know the jury is sequestered and they working on the trap. I don't know by the time I finish making this video, you think they gonna have a verdict? They gonna free Derek Chavez? I think they want to. Have y'all heard about the new law that old big head ass the Sanchez, the governor of Florida has signed and put in the law saying that okay, say you're out there protesting and you just happen to be around some people, you know, that might be a little rowdy. Everybody gonna get arrested and they gonna throw you your innocent ass in jail right along with the rowdy ones. And you can't go Get, it ain't no get out of jail free card the next day. He said that you're not going to be able to get out of jail until you see a judge. And if you convicted, I think it's five years, allegedly. All this stuff allegedly. Y'all have to do y'all research and check this stuff out. A law, he got a he got a, a, a riot law for the state of Florida. Check it out. And I think it's just a way to keep black folks from protesting and defending our rights and stuff. They trying to stop us in any way they can. Y'all research those racist voter right laws they passed in Georgia and they want to do it in Texas and other states. Those red states that don't want black folks or people of color to vote because the white racist, white supremacist man want to stay in charge so he can keep his thumb or his knee on our neck. God damn it. Boy, what black folks are gonna do? Keep saying, "Oh, if if uh, Derek Chavez is not, you know, convicted, it's okay. We just gonna keep on trying. Trying what? To beg the white man to stop beating on y'all and killing y'all and begging him for another chance to live? I don't know, but." All that stuff ain't working. You can get be in the street. Now, y'all can be in the street and protest. Okay, fine. But you see the law that they just put out in Florida, and they're going to probably pass, try and pass that same law in other states to keep y'all black folks from doing anything. So you're going to have to come up with something else because they're going to stop you from doing anything to try and make life easier for you and to stop all these old racist laws and stuff. You see they ain't passed the the laws in Congress so all this stuff can be kicked out I don't know why they waiting what the hell going on oh the mole allegedly is um, Joe Manson and that Christie one whatever her name is and a couple of other ones holding up shit why they want to hold up a voter right act a voter right act and why would they want to hold up the George Floyd act to have these racist white supremacist white nationalist cops convicted for the crimes and all the stuff they causing around the damn country they need to pass these laws and i don't know what's what's taking them so long y'all got the answer y'all got any ideas you got any theories reasons excuses why they doing this shit to us now anyway i know this is a grocery haul what else we got up here my husband, he got him some more chicken tamales, and he got some more beef tamales, and he got some more of these potatoes. These are good potatoes, y'all ain't never tried them. All this stuff came from uh, Smart and Final. And we got some more eggs. See my eggs? I filled it up, my egg containers. Yes, I did. 
But yeah, if y'all got the answers to some of this stuff, solutions to the problems they causing us, and what you gonna do? Because all this protesting and just crying, please stop hurting us, please stop killing us. They are not listening because they are in charge and they not gonna change nothing. That's why they're trying so hard to stop us from voting because they know if you vote, you can get the racist, white supremacist, the white nationalists out of the government and then people with some sense and some compassion for others can run these damn uh, states. Because this is just too much. Aren't you guys fed up with this mess? I'm just sick of black people talking about, oh, if we don't, if it, if George, if uh, Derek Chavez ain't convicted, we gonna be all right. We just gonna keep on fighting. Fighting for what? You think that's gonna be the last black man killed? You see, what's his name? Uh, dang, I lost my for the uh, the right boy that was just murdered by the white woman that said she didn't know she had a gun in her hand and put and uh. She thought she had the taser 26 years on the force and she was training those guys and her ass don't know a gun from a taser. They lie. White folks lie. The white nationalists, white supremacist people, they just lie and they're in charge and they running shit and ain't nothing going to be right until they out of office. So a whole lot more people of color got to get out there and start voting and start doing some change that way because... I don't know. They trying to stop the protests. Y'all watch this. In Florida, it's going to go somewhere else. They already started with all these racist voting right laws to keep y'all from voting, make it hard for you guys to vote. We're going to see what our sister, what her name, uh, Stacey Abram, and it's another lady. I forget her name. It's a bunch of them out there that try to help make things right, but going to need just a few people, going to need a whole bunch of people to stop this madness going on because all these old Jim Crow laws they passing out and smiling as they do it. I can't just imagine. If y'all don't want to keep this mess continue, you got to come up with something better than just protesting. Come up people with some good ideas and solutions to help stop this. And you know voting is one idea, but they're trying to make it where you can't vote. So I don't know what the hell we're going to do in this situation. If y'all know, leave it in the comments. And I thank you for watching this grocery haul. But this is a good grocery haul. Y'all see, I found me some chicken wings. My husband and I, we love our chicken wings. One day, he gonna come on my video and meet y'all and tell you how much he loves chicken wings and how much he loves frying them. Bye. People, people, we wanted some more fresh chicken wings. But lo and behold, somebody, someone, Bought all those chicken wings up. Like my husband and I, we got those three packs. We was lucky to get those. Went back looking for more. Ain't no more. They bought them all. So, like I showed you, we found some frozen ones at the Smart and Final. But our preference is our preference is the fresh ones, cause we really don't like all that stuff pumped into them. But they all right. They ain't. It's okay. It's okay. But fresh is best. All right. And I don't know, I forgot to tell y'all, I know what I was trying to mention also in this video. Y'all seen how they trying to pick on Maxine Waters because she was speaking her piece. I don't know why the white supremacists always thinking they can just pull a fast one. Ain't nobody feeling no kind of way about Maxine Waters. Whatever she said, it was nothing wrong with that. She just telling people to protest, protest, protest. If, you, if that's what all can be done at this time is protesting, then protest peacefully. Protest because remember, I already mentioned about the new riot laws they got going on in Florida. Innocent people can be involved with the rowdy ones and go to jail and get so many years. And do your research, like I said, so y'all can see what the hell I'm talking about. But in the meanwhile, leave Maxine alone. And more power to you, Maxine. Keep standing up for the black folks. Well, people of color. Because we need you and we need more like you. I hope this grocery haul was a pleasure to watch. And I hope it helped you guys remember something that you might have forgot to get from the store. Once again, thanks for watching.